When on holiday, we often come across small specialised museums. Ones where pride of possession, rather than a need to educate, was the raison d'etre. The similarity of two recently visited museums in particular prompted me to produce this show. The colourful character of the owners and the rural environment in which they operate was the attraction. Each hold a collection of cultural significance and both have numerous examples of the owner's particular choice of exhibits on display. The English Channel separates the two locations and we first visit Orchard Mill, home to the Bakelite Museum, located in the west of England. Bakelite was invented in 1907 and was immensely successful. The proprietor of the museum, Patrick Cook, has accrued a large collection of nostalgic products, products that utilise this pioneering plastic material. Bakelite touched every aspect of 20th century life, from the cradle to the grave. Produced in a wonderful range of colours and varied textures, there's so much more to vintage plastics than just brown radios. Most any domestic appliance would include Bakelite parts. Others were made totally from the material. How many of these do you remember? Moving on, though not by caravan, we visit the central region of France. The Musée de la Cafetière occupies the Forge Mill in Charente. The proprietor, Rémy Papot, started his collection of coffee-related products with this, his first decorative enameled cafetière. He now owns well over 2,000 similar cafetières. There are many other coffee related items to be found in the museum. You will spot coffee packaging, coffee makers, grinders, cups and saucers, jugs also. The exhibits are not confined to shelves, they also cover the floor and hang from the ceilings. Other items that have attracted Monsieur Papo's attention include shopping baskets and charcoal stoves. Some beautifully decorated. In the year 2000, this collection was awarded a Guinness Book of Records Diploma. We have visited each museum twice in the last decade and I must say they have given us much pleasure on each occasion. Thank you.